Hey, what's good, man? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Mac, and we tapping in with another great video. Uh, today, we're gonna be taking a look at my latest pickup on feet, um, which is the Penny 5 in the Invisibility Cloak colorway. So, Nike decided to re-release this sneaker after eight years, man. This shoe originally came out in 2012, which seemed like yesterday, man. 2012 does not seem that long ago, but um, that's when this sneaker dropped. And when it first came out, people had mixed reviews on, you know, the Penny 5. Some people liked it, some people different. Um, typical, you know, feedback when it comes to a new sneaker, but I always liked it. And I ended up picking up the uh, Phoenix Suns colorway, and I did a review on that colorway as well. Showing y'all my latest pickup. Went out, picked up the Penny 5 Phoenix Suns colorway. So, this particular colorway in 2012, 2013, this joint sold out immediately. As soon as it came out, this colorway sold out. People were on eBay um, reselling these for crazy prices. Um, I'm gonna give you guys a close up of the sneaker to show you why people were reselling this sneaker. So this shoe has an iridescent look to it. Um, whenever you put it against a certain light or depending on how you have it in the light, it will change colors. And it also has a glow in the dark bottom which is another reason why this sneaker was so popular you know it was around the time all-star pack the nike uh, galaxy pack came out and most of those sneakers had glow in the dark shoes as well so this kind of just um picked up on that wave and ended up making the prices go up high so the fact that this sneaker was so highly sought after in 2012 it just shocked me that Nike released this sneaker and nobody really talked about it. And it's actually on sale right now. So I scooped these up for 80 bucks. Retail price is 160. So to be able to get this sneaker that I really wanted in 2012 for way below retail is crazy. Um, I'm very, very excited for this shoe. And I, again, you know, a lot of people may not like it even in 2020, but I think it's a clean sneaker. And I'm always rock, you know, quote unquote basketball shoes. I think it looks really, really clean on feet. And if for any of you guys who are on the fence about copying these, I think my own feet is going to push you over the top and allow you to pick these up. And like I said, some of you guys may not even have known that this sneaker retro. So very, very nice, man. Give you guys one last look. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go to the on feet shots and we'll check back in.
right, man, so we back. We check it back in. I just showed y'all what the Penny 5 looked like on feet. And as always with my videos, with my channel, I had to give you different looks with different jeans in order to help you make your decision on this sneaker. So now that you saw that, I want you to leave your opinion on the Penny 5. Let me know if you're feeling this sneaker. Let me know if you think it's trash. And also just let me know what you thought about my on feet. Um, as, far as, uh, as far as sizing, man, this sneaker is very, very narrow. So without question, if you have wide feet, you definitely want to go up half size. Even if you have normal feet, you might want to go up a half size as well. That's just how narrow this sneaker is. So I know people are gonna, still going to ask that question, but I answered it in the video and I'm probably going to end up answering it in the comment section as well. But that is it for this sneaker, man. The Penny 5 Invisibility Cloaks. If you're on the fence, man, I highly recommend you scoop these up. Um, they're on sale right now at Foot Locker for $80. So go grab those. Definitely a sleeper sneaker of the year. This is flying under a lot of people's radar. So if you want something different in your collection, um, go ahead and, and scoop these up and add them to your collection. But other than that, that is it, man. We're going to go ahead and get up out of here. We've got a lot more content coming. Stay tuned. Stay locked into the channel. And uh, thank y'all for supporting me, man. I'll see y'all in the next video.